Hey everybody, Dr. Brandy here. So like I mentioned last week, this week's video is on spinal decompression. So what it is, what it's for, how it works. So uh, spinal decompression is a method that's been around for a long time um, and its goal is to work on the discs of the spine. So what can happen is these discs, we're gonna bring, bring back Fred here. <clears throat> these are the bones of your spine and in between are your discs. Now your discs act like shock absorbers for your spine. They serve a lot of purposes, but one of the ones that I wanna focus on today is the fact that these discs, when they're nice and healthy, they help keep these openings where these nerves come out nice and big. Now, like I mentioned, sometimes things happen. Uh, whether it's a sporting injury, a car crash injury, uh, or a lifting injury, um, sometimes what happens is those discs no longer stay within their boundaries. And there is an example of that depicted on this guy right here. So this is kind of showing how those discs are no longer within their boundary and they're starting to narrow and protrude and put pressure on this nerve that it feeds right here. Now what decompression is, is a method that we can use to help um, encourage that disc to go back where it should be. Now for some people this is a last ditch effort before they were told they had to have surgery. Um, and we've had some people that have been told that they no longer need surgery because they did decompression. So it's a wonderful thing to try. You have nothing to lose. Um, but what it does, and I'm going to show you kind of what it does. So this is our spinal decompression machine right here. And we are very fortunate in the fact that we have one of the better machines on the market. Uh, so we're very blessed that we have some of the better technology that's out there and we can bring that to you. And this is our table. So what happens is we strap you into the table and we lift the table to accommodate wherever your particular disc issue may be. And if you'll notice, this table actually separates right here. Now that helps with the pulling because what happens is we strap you into this table and then it pulls. When it pulls, it's encouraging that disc to go back within its boundaries and it's also inviting water to come back into the disc. Water is what keeps those discs nice and fluffy and helps them act like a shock absorber. So this machine is wonderful in the sense that we are we can get very specific and we can add more pressure than just, uh, or excuse me, more pull than just your body weight and gravity. Um, I've had several patients ask me in the past, well, what do you think about those uh, inversion tables? I think they have a place. However, I think a machine like ours is much better. Uh, the reason I feel that way is, I, A, I've seen people, like I've mentioned, that were told, hey, you need surgery. They didn't want surgery. They wanted to see if there was something else out there. And they tried decompression and didn't have to have surgery. So I've seen it do amazing things. So I can testify personally to that that fact. And the other thing is that we can get very specific with a table like this and target specific areas. Uh, what I dislike or um, am less keen on with those inversion tables is that it flips you all upside down. Well, what if you have spots on you that don't need that particular therapy? You are actually, sometimes you can make those areas more susceptible to injury by doing things to them that they don't need. So with this machine, we can be very specific um, and target just those areas that need it. And the other thing is that you're kind of limited with those in the sense that you can only use your weight and gravity. With a table like this, we can use much more pull um, and get better results a lot quicker. Um, so I think that we are very fortunate and blessed that we have this, this uh, technology in our office and I've seen it work wonders on people before who praise it up and down. Um, so if you are one of those people that are looking for something different, something new, or if you are one that you've been told that you have a disc issue, um, stop at the office. Ask Dr. Tuck and I if you have any questions. Um, let us do an evaluation on you, see if you are a candidate for it, um, and see what we can do for you. There's no need to suffer needlessly. There's no need to get surgery if you don't have to have it. So stop at the office see what we can do for you. Um, that's what I have for you today. If you guys have any questions, like I said, just stop by. Otherwise, I will see you guys next week in the next video.